Ah, welcome time travelers and welcome new time travelers. As always, if you're new to this channel and enjoy learning about history, not only from the US, but also from around the world, don't forget to hit that like button, comment, subscribe, and turn on all notifications. Without further ado, let's get into it. Today we're going to start out in 351 when Roman Emperor Constantius II defeated the Usper Magnetus in a battle of Mursa, the bloodiest battle in the 4th century. Moving on to 1066, when William, Duke of Normandy, landed in the southeastern England, thus beginning the Normandy Conquest, which resulted in his become, him becoming king. Um, Julian, explorer Julian Rodriguez Cabrillo, known as the discoverer of California, landed on this day in 1542 near what is now San Diego and became the first European to set foot on the west coast of what would become the United States. 1781 is when the siege of Yorktown began, eventually leading on October 19th to the British surrender by General Lloyd, Lord Cornwalls, and the end of the American Revolution. Um, 1850 is when flogging was banned as punishment in the U.S. Navy. Not entirely sure what flogging is. If anyone has any idea what that is, let me know in the comments section. 1911 is when using the pretext of infringement of Italian interest in the Turkish province of Tropolana and Corsana in uh, Libya, Libya, the Italian government issued an ultimatum to Turkey and declared war the next day. Nineteen years later, no, I'm sorry, nine years later, in 1920, in what became known as the Black Sox Scandal, eight members of the Chicago White Sox baseball team were indicted by a grand jury on charges that they had thrown the 1919 World Series in the Cincinnati Reeds in return for a bribe. Um, 1958 is when Madagascar voted to, for autonomy with the French community. Um, 1965 is when Cuma, Cuban Prime Minister Fidel Castro offers to permit the free immigration of all Cubans who wish to join relatives in the U.S. Um, five years later, in 1970, UAR President Gamal Abdel Nasser suffered a fatal heart attack after Cairo Airport ceremonies ended the Arab Summit, summit meeting. Three years after the turn of the century, in 2003, tennis player Athea Gibson, the first African American to win a single, win singles title at the French Open in 1956, Wimbledon in 1957 to 1958, and the U.S. Open 
1957 and 1958, died at the age of 76. <sighs> now, 2008 is when SpaceX successfully launched Falcon 1, Falcon 1, sorry, becoming the first privately owned company to send a liquid-fueled rocket into orbit. Two years later, in 2010, Russian President Dmitry Medvedev dismiss dismisses political rival Yuri Lezfek as mayor of Moscow. And our final event happened in 2016 when Polish-born Israel statesman Shimon Prayers, who served as Prime Minister from 1984 to 1986 and 1995 to 1996, and President from 27, 2007 to 2014 of Israel, and shared the Nobel Prize for Peace in 1994 for helping to negotiate the Oslo Accords, the historic Israeli PLO Peace Agreement of 1993 died in Ramon GAN. I'm not entirely sure why that is. Now, let's head to the animal kingdom, where only 5% of cheetah cups survive to adulthood. A study in the 1990s in the Serengeti found that 95% of cheetah cubs died before reaching adulthood. Many deaths were due to lions, but other, also other predators and diseases. Now let's head into the science lab, where fish form orderly cues and emergencies when evacuating through a narrow species in sketchy situations schools of neon terra fish cues so that they don't collide or clog up the line scientists interpret this behavior as showing that fish can respect social rules even in emergency situations unlike us humans. And with that, I hope if you find it, these this day in history interesting, you will consider hitting that like button, commenting, subscribing, and turning on all notifications. With that, I'll see you all in the next one.